Oh, right. Yeah, part two of Pachetti. Um, I've got to say, the Joe Pesci, I rushed it, but I love him. When Bichetti said that, I was walking out the other night, and that just come in my head last night. It just come in my head. I rushed it, but I love him. And that's just hilarious. But anyway, part two. Let's go. Twitter, Twitter real there, fast. Sam. Just All ignore right. it on Twitter, of course. Guys, this is so much fun. I'm, I'm really excited. Oh, Thank good. you for having me. No We're having a blast, Mike. Let me pull up... Uh... Let me see. Jim Norton. <laughs> oh, no. See how fat I am, Jim? You never knew me that fat, really. I, was, <laughs> I, mean, I only might put a couple I was on. half that, Jim, at least. <laughs> ah, you got it. You, you gained a couple pounds. It's okay. But, Mike, you got your two don't, fingers Don't you up. worry. Got, oh. So it looks like you're commenting on the size of your genitals. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. It's hard to find them. Oh, God. I, oh, now I'm so fat. It's Are like, you a two-finger jerk-off guy when you jerk off? How do you jerk off? I just, I yell a lot, though. Like, grab and just, like, pull it like it's a banana. It's going to come out of the... Out of the uh, you know, skin. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how do you, you? Is that how you jerk? I just grab it and I, like, I hold on to it. Like it's, it's the best thing that ever happened to me. And just you know, do you want it with your whole fist or two fingers? What? Well, just whole hand. Oh, you grab okay. it. So, yeah. It's, you have big penis. Uh, I think I'm average. I guess if you, you know, I don't, I wouldn't say I'm large. You know, like average. I would say for a fact, like about five. A little more, maybe an inch more. Six. No I, I don't know what's average today. Who knows? Your you big know? girthy head. Oh, I got I got a gigantic nutsack though, which is good. Chicks like big balls, I think. <laughs> I, think I think I'm speculating here. It's been a while, so but uh, you got a big bag. No. Yeah, I love that. It's, that's the best part of it. The bag, the bag is where the joy juice comes from. You know. Do you juggle it while you're jerking? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I love I love screaming stuff when I'm done doing it too. Like, what? You know, you're like what? What do you scream? I mean, what would you scream? Like, like Michael come Richards on, you the Laugh Factory. <laughs> I'd be like, come on, you whore, suck this thing. Like, there's no tomorrow. You know, I, I like stuff. Oh, like, sexy really. stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah like, I actually like tough, keep it nice. Tough chicks that are cool. Oh, really? Like leather Tuscadero type chick. Oh, yeah, man. yeah, yeah, yeah. Should we get you a check? Joan Jet. Joan Jett was, oh, man, Joan yeah. was hot and back in, oh, God almighty. You're like a little Joan Jett? Pat Benatar, yeah. I was a huge fan of hot. Yeah. Yeah. I'd love to have a hot, I just need a hot whore, really. I don't really want to go. Look at that. Who's know? that? Leather Tuscadero? Leather Tuscadero. Look out. So you Whoa. say suck it like there's no tomorrow? Yeah, yeah. 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 While you're jerking off? Just text me when you need me. I, don't, I like friends with better. Does she cry because she's upset because there's no tomorrow? <laughs> That would be very upsetting. Yeah. It's like no tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> I'll suck it like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> I oh, no. I understand a cheap plug for my Twitter, but I just, uh, I tweeted that video of you trying to sneeze oh, from Audi Lang show. Thank it's you fucking so, so hilarious. Much. Blow that shit up for, for Mikey. Thank you. Thank you. And follow my Twitter. I, I, I put your Twitter on there, too. So. Thank you so much. Holy fuck. What are you promoting, Mike? Oh, yeah, 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 my yeah, pal, yeah. Mike Bichetti. Actually, uh, Jim, I'm on a, uh, I, I was telling Opie, I created a web series called Tubby Man about a fat superhero. Okay. You can go to www.savemetubbyman.com. Oh. I'm going to actually be uh, doing a casino down in, um, what do you call it, um, November 7th and 8th in a, oh, oh God. You, I, 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 I'll help you out. Deuces Wild? Is that yeah, it? Yeah. Oh, no, you're doing two, though. On, on November 7th, uh, Mike Bichetti is going to be at Deuces Wild Comedy Club in Valley Forge Casino. And then on the 8th of November in the Waterford Room at the Valley Forge Casino. Yeah, I'm so oh, sorry. Okay, so they got Thank a you. couple different rooms. And they, also the 19th, uh, what, with, uh, this coming up uh, October 19th at 9 o'clock, you're in Staten Island at the Looney Bin with Angel Salazar. Oh, Angel It's going to be fun. And I think Ch Chips is there. Tony, What's that? Go on, Ch yo. Chips Cooney. What's that? Yeah, I love him. Open Guys, the fucking I... door, Tony. Open the fucking door, Tony. <laughs> Come on, yo. Tony. Ernie, you Tony. got a job, man. <laughs> Guys, I feel comfortable. Thank. I was nervous when I was coming. Oh, that's no, 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 problem. It's all good. No, I just, I don't know. I get nervous. I didn't. I we just hang out. We watch stupid film trailers. Goof around nervous? a little. You get nervous. That's the kind of guy I am, really. But I had a great time, now. You're a nervous type. Yeah. Are yeah. you? What makes you nervous? I don't know. You know, it's just that that's how I am. You know, it's it's hard to explain, but. <laughs> dung, 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 nervous. <laughs> yeah. Did you play football? I played baseball actually. I did I better. I I was a good hitter, but a horrible fielder. Yeah. Uh -huh. They keep me way, 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 way out of the outfield. You know, it's like. What would it come at you, and you'd just be like, "Oh my God, I'm fucking 15 steps oh, too yeah, yeah. far behind this." Or, no, yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> Jimmy was, would spin around in the outfield. Yeah. I'm a decent hitter, but like you a know, little fucking 
<laughs> Very tarred. <laughs> you would make a horrible third base coach. Oh, God, You'd be yeah. waving every single player over. No. They, they, they would crucify me at the plate when I get over there, believe me. <laughs> Can you sit still, you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'll sit back. That, yeah. That's how I'm work over there. I'm like, no, I'm just always... asking. I don't, you don't have to. No, I'll, See, I'll you can't do it. <laughs> oh yeah, he wasn't yeah. saying, "Can you sit still?" Oh, he was no, asking. No, no, yeah, no, I'm not can. being. Not that you should, but let's try to sit still, not say it. Like just try for to thirty talk. seconds. I want to see if you can sit still. Yeah. Sit still, starting right now. But okay. you got to answer questions too. Okay, I'm I'm close to the mic. I'm good. Hands just moved. Yeah, yeah. So were you will you play the league? What position? I was way way in the outfield. Do you want to fuck Christina Ricci? Heavily, she's hot. Those tits are huge. Nah, nah. <laughs> he's, 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 he's doing a little he's nature nature rumble. He's nah, nah. rumbling a little. His <laughs> shoulder, shoulders nah, started nah. moving. You know, just... All right, let's try this again. Let's try this again. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. This is oh, no. I missed that. Hey, I'm, I'm close to the mic. I'm good. Hands just moved. Yeah, yeah. So, will you, will you play the league? What position? I was way, way in the outfield. Do you want to fuck Christina Ricci? Heavily. She's hot. Those tits are huge. That forehead. She's <laughs> yeah, he's, he's doing a little he's nature rumble. rumble. Probably, he was rumbling a little. His <laughs> shoulder, shoulder started moving. You know, just, All right, let's try this again. Let's try this again. Okay, let's try this again. This is hilarious. All right, we got our first bit with Mike Bichette. Oh, my God. He can't stay still. All right, stay still. Can I stay like this? <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Starting yeah, right. Down, no shrugging. Right. Now go. So when you when you jerk off to Christina, uh, not Christina, what's her name? Christina, Christina Ricci? Ricci. Oh yeah. And you yeah, really want to suck her big tits? Those things are gigantic. Just, oh fuck. They're, they're... I think she got. A, I think she got a breast reduction though, didn't I she? I know that sucks. Why did she, she listen to? P I think she decided. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bob I think was on her ass. Get those tits shrunken. You know. What I, I mean? No, I think she had like back problems and stuff. Is that her uh, right there? Ooh. Oh, uh, no, what happened to her? She looked, She got fucking dump tack tits now. <laughs> wow. Those are nice. That looks yeah. pretty fucking yeah. nice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God almighty. Right God. there. Hunters, right? Where does she, what movie is she naked in like that? Your big balls hanging on the floor. <laughs> oh, no. no. <laughs> she has, oh, God. Oh, God. It's, Your uh, fucking huge bag. Yeah. That oh. isn't her. Oh, yeah, it is. You can tell from the face. Oh, oh is that it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow, That's she has shown her tits photo. in a lot of movies. Those so. foreheads. Requiem. You, you got to reckon. Oh, just, I like the second one. She's so cute. Oh, man. Yeah, you she like that one right forehead. there? Her forehead's yeah. a little big. She has there, a Mike. big round head, Absolutely. and her forehead is giant. That's okay. I, Bangs you know, do her well. Yeah, would you bang her? I'd, I'd like to shoot that like load off that forehead and drip oh, it off. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure lickets. she'd appreciate that. That'd yeah. be a lot of load. <laughs> Nothing a girl loves more <laughs> right. than the cum of a psychopath <laughs> dripping <laughs> on her forehead. <laughs> to first acknowledge the, the birth defect with some cum. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's where you want to yes. put your cum, yeah. <laughs> right, Her Jesus. most sensitive, humiliating spot. <laughs> yeah, but I can be a gentleman, too. I like. How about you start with a candle like dinner or something, Mike? Jesus. No, no, you're right, because, like... Right nice. to the jizz to the forehead, my Be a God. gentleman, you know, you're right. I, I, yeah. That's the whole thing, but guys, well, everybody I know, all the guy, friend, people I'm friends with, like, women want to be treated like dog shit. Those, that's how you get them. Uh-huh. I don't know how true that is. I always... Oh, it's nice it's true. Guy, you just fucking pick them up, throw them in a plastic bag, and dump them in the garbage. <laughs> Like dog shit. I was always a nice guy. Maybe that's the, maybe that's the problem. Yeah, yeah you sound like, like you jerk you. off, you yell whore. Is that Christina Ricci? That's Christina right there? Ricci. Wow, what movie is this? Black Snake Moan. Oh, that stupid fucking oh, Samuel fuck. Jackson. I'm disappointed movie. in her now. She's I didn't, fucking now. Uh, and uh, oh god, I'm disappointed in my. How come? You don't like seeing her with Justin Timberlake? Uh, yeah, I bet I she's a good fuck. I bet oh, she is. God. She's a psych she plays all psychos in movies. She has to. Yeah. You fuck her. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Would you let her suck your balls? I'd That's say like, suck those, suck if, that ball. If you were Christina Ricci's boyfriend and she did this role, you'd be like, she's fucking him. Yeah. I'd be yeah. freaked out. I'd be, I'd be Would so you? bummed out. Yeah, Would I'd you be, be like, bummed out? I'd be, I'd be like, what's I Justin Timberlake got that you? Oh. I, I, I don't want to fucking see you again, you whore. After that. I'd, wow, I'd that looks mad good right like, there. Look you'd at be that. mad at that, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Very you want her to be all yours, girl? I like that. Oh, blow that up. Whoa. Now go over. What's she got? Tat. Tat tits, she has just great for the movie. Tits. Yes, for the oh, yeah. uh, for the movie. Wow, she does. Uh, she looks she nice good. Look at how much better with the bangs oh, there, Mike. Jimmy, she's like thirty three now. I know exactly. I think she's born nineteen eighty. I don't oh, remember exactly. Boy, uh oh, that's a little <laughs> much. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, the finger goes up. He goes. Ah. <laughs> Love it. 
<laughs> Can we see the sneeze? I, I again? love the sneeze video. Did you post that yet? Oh, it's yeah, very funny. I, I went, that one's a <laughs> must see. Do you yeah. like that, Sam? Oh God, oh, it's so great. It's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Why didn't you just sneeze? Fuck it. No, you don't have to. Like, to. You, you look like you, like you look like a muppet. I didn't even know it was on camera. Really, that looks like a muppet all the time. <laughs> Why were you holding back a sneeze? That I could be the sneeze. worst thing to try to do. No, I think he wanted to sneeze. Yeah. But couldn't, so he's oh, up oh, looking oh, at the okay. lights. He's trying. Yeah, yeah. Anthony, that's it. I couldn't sneeze. Yeah, yeah, he's trying to sneeze. It's like he's searching in his brain for the sneeze. <laughs> yeah, like his sneeze yeah. is all the way up at the top uh, of his head. Oh, fuck. Like, we've funny. all been there. Wow. I, gotta I didn't know it was on okay. camera though, until, they, until they played it on the show. What happened? <laughs> what happened to I, I got to retweet Obi the video. That's fucking great. Oh, it's hilarious. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> it's really funny, Mike. We wow. can pull that video up, make you a big. St well, you're a star already. No, no, we no, kidding. I, thank you, guys. Now, Otto and George tweeted me and said, "Did I see Drop in Science? You made a few great appearances on the Pig Roast." Yeah, it was oh. fun. I, I, wow. Yeah, I used to like that. I know it was, was fun. On. It was very funny. I loved it. I loved when Otto went out to the back to the little patio yeah. area. Yeah, yeah. And just had a little chat and out just there, hung out and talked. And I went through the newspaper with George. Yes, <laughs> very funny. Fucking great. Just gotta bring that back. Uh, what did you, you do on that thing? I actually had a meltdown one day with a with a, uh -oh. with a listener actually called yeah. in and heckled me, and I didn't know it was on. I, it was at the end of the show, and I blew my top, and I didn't, I didn't realize I was being taped. <laughs> who's, who's your top? <laughs> yeah. Wait, where, yeah, where so is that? The, what bottom does you blow it's the on, top? It's, I think it's definitely online because some woman called in. I, I you know, I like California a lot. I want to move out there one day eventually. Oh. I love L.A. Right, and she's like. You're a delusion. She was like breaking my chops. I go, honey, you don't even know me. Don't call me delusion. Oh, and then, shit. And then oh, we got to find this. It started, and then I just, <clears throat> after the show was over, I I, I said, you, I called the, uh, I can say it here, I called her a, a cunt. Oh, oh man. Oh, wow. No, not on the air, though, but uh, after the show was done, they got me on tape. You should say, uh, hey. Rocker. Don't call me delusional. I'll, I'll stop being your boyfriend. <laughs> oh, I want to see Yana. Uh, I never, I never, get, I never blow my top. It takes a long no, time huh? for me to get angry. Really. Yeah, yeah. She upset you though. Yeah, I just no, you know what it is. No, sometimes no. I don't know. You Fucking know. bitches gonna be bitches, yo. I hear you. That's why I really, you know, with Twitter, I used to fight back with people and they heckled me, but now I just oh. block them. It ain't even That's really, what you right? do. Just block them block all. Them. Right. Listen to them. No, they're morons. They're like my goal is to block every single follower I have. At some point. <laughs> that's my final. That's how you win at Twitter. And then you no, finally turn you off. Finally, just turn, you finally turn off. Finally turn off. I blocked everyone that follows me. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, Mike. Mike, great, wow. uh, great time. Wow. Thank Absolutely. you, guys. You were Fucking got, pisser. Thank you for having me. This no was so problem. much fun. No, we'll have you back if, if thank you'll, uh, if Hell you'll yeah. come back. Hell's no, yeah. I'd love to come back. I appreciate Look, this. We never so stay, much fun. We never stay after a school no, no. like this. All right, it's Mike Bichetti on Twitter. I'm going to spell out Bichetti. B-O-C-C-H-E-T-T-I. Mike Bichetti. On Twitter. On Twitter. Of course, he announces for the Artie Lang Show. Which is on every night, pretty much, right? Uh, we're on 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. Direct TV Monday to Friday, and oh. I I know we're on Sirius, but I'm not sure what terrestrial we're on as well. I'm not really sure about radio, about that part of it. So tune in on Sirius XM. Yeah. Where where though? Uh, what channel? I don't know. channel. I'm not really sure. I, I should know this. You all probably right. should. People. Will oh, find there you it, are in the say. movie. Getting held up. Oh, is that yeah, it? Yeah, that's me. Look, oh, my God. Look at that. It was awesome. Oh, that's nice. I wish yeah. I had that beard, though. I can't it's even funny to see you can't mocking, grow a beard? It's funny no. to see you mocking Jews like that. No, oh, I'm not man. mocking them. in my people. Oh, well, my cousin's right. half Italian, half Jewish. I'm mocking them. All right, 243. Okay. 243. Extreme talk? Extreme talk on Sirius oh, XM. Oh, right. thank you, buddy. Now I know myself. Very cool. I'm not sure. <laughs> They're going to hang me at work. They're like, we're not fat idiot. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And I, I guess just go to MikeBachetti.com for all the uh, tour dates. Right? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, uh, Mike, it was a pleasure. It was so much fun, guys. This is, I, I'm really oh, excited. Oh, man, you. no prop. What a pisser. I love Jim. We, I know Jim 20 years, at least. Yeah. Fuck yeah, man. Maybe. More than that. God, that long, huh? Yeah, since 1991. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, he was always a funny guy from day one. Uh, what happened? <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I just think the big. And a cool guy to me because when I was a new comic, 
a lot of people broke my balls because my comedy is kind those of different. Those big balls? And, yeah, those and, and big, heavy always, balls. Giant Jim fucking. Jim was always a friend of me now. He always Heavy, was. heavy, weighty yeah, balls. They broke those big fucking, that big delicious sack. <laughs> that big fucking cum spewing angry sack. <laughs> that <laughs> giant cum factory you call a ball sack. <laughs> but you said your comedy is different. Why? Uh, In what way? Uh, you know, I'm not a traditional guy talking about. You know, mayonnaise and bullshit and ketchup and being <laughs> friendly to TV and, you know, all that stuff. <laughs> Mustard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Like, I just, I, I talk about my dad being, you know, an alcoholic and a drug addict and all kinds of stuff. What? And, That's hilarious. But the, every, but, but, the, but the, no, I know the jokes. The that networks are afraid of originality, though. That's what it is. That's why I love you guys and all, all people are different oh, because man. everybody's terrified of originality. Yeah. How bad was the alcoholism? Uh, I drank forever from like age 14 to like my late 30s. No, I was, I was 36. Talking, I was talking about your dad. Oh, my dad, though. oh, he was brutal. He was an animal when he got drunk. Oh, boy. Not fun, huh? No. My mom's the best. She's a single mom and she raised five of us. He hit you, your father? Uh, now he wouldn't be able to. He's old, but I mean, you know. Wow. But back then, I mean. No, not really. He'd do a lot of yelling and throwing stuff. Okay. You Still like him? Bed. Uh, he's a reasonable guy. This humongous is a reasonable <laughs> he's a re man. He's a reasonable guy. I'll talk to this humongous. You see him still? Actually, he's pretty sick right now. He's in a nursing home. i got to go visit him, actually. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, you know, what are you going to do? What's wrong with him? He has a problem. He, he couldn't breathe. And they had to That's do an operation problem. on like a tracheotomy or whatever it is. Tracheotomy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's okay. I mean, you know, things happen. How old a gentleman is he? 75. Okay. How old He's are you? I'm the beautiful age of 52, unfortunately. Wow. There you go. Okay. I had to put you younger than that. Yeah. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. That, <laughs> you don't oh, have you got to the really. finger thing. I know. I got the two fingers. Nice. Double fingers. <laughs> Double fingers. <laughs> Double fingers. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, uh, it, it's, I just love doing what I do. I mean, this is so cool because, I mean, it took me a long time to get where I did, but it's worth every minute of this. Yeah. Happen, Roland. Roland sitting back there. What's up, Rolly? That movie made me want to cry. Though I can't, I can't stop thinking of, of Michael it, the Woodsman. Oh, oh man, the Woods, the Woods. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Wow, I've never seen him before. I'm not up to Shirley normally. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I, you got, I'm just in, an exhibit with you guys. I love this <laughs> what movie made you want to cry? De Niro's. I'm like, fuck, what happened to him? Oh, oh that way, yeah, yeah. And, and Michael Douglas and, and that, and, oh, God. Well, Michael Douglas looked great in there. You know, he's all tan. Ah, nice a, full head of hair. That's a formula movie. It'll do well. Whatever. But he's just doing nothing but garbage I, for I years. They should have fucking did something else. Oh, those guys. Shit. Nobody has any, any balls to do anything. They're afraid of their own shadow. Yeah. De Niro just gave up on, yeah. like, I mean, well, or, or, I, people just don't give him good scripts anymore? I can't imagine that. Even Silver Lining Playbook got rewarded because it was the first thing he did in years that just was just different than a dumb comedy. And that was awful. Like, it's got to be easier to just do these shit movies than it's like, oh, my God, I got to really act. and Right. I got to be the guy for a while, get into the character. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah it's, it's, the, it's because of Meet the Parents. He was, yeah. he was really... He, he killed it in Meet the Parents, especially the first movie. So yeah. now it's like, okay, that's what I got to do now. A million of these type of movies. That sucks. Too bad. Yeah. I wanted to. I, uh, I wasn't impressed oh. with him in Silver Lining Playbook. Me neither, bro. No. I thought he was all right. Exactly. But it wasn't a, an over the top performance by any means. That was a bunch of bunk, if you ask me. Bring there it back go. to Cape Fear, things like that. Oh, awesome. God, Cape Fear. Sure, world. and you relate to the way he, he talks to a girl, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. That's how you have sex. <laughs> I hear you do the laugh from Cape Fear. I actually like the movie Full Metal Jacket. That's one of my favorites. So I'll just like... Oh, you do any uh, impressions from that uh, movie? I, uh, yeah, Pile on the Toilet. I like when he goes, Pile, Joker, Snowball! I just That's my favorite when he's calling him out. And Pile, I felt sorry for him in the long run. I mean, he was... Oh. A, yeah. Yeah. But it was a good movie, though. I like all the army, though. I'd love to meet him one day. We met him. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He, How, he yelled at us, too. Really? Yeah, for real. He's a badass, though. I'm sure he can fight still, right? Do you think... No. He's, well, not really. Oh, Nowadays, wow. it's crazy. You didn't hear what happened to him, which makes it really awkward now. Oh, no. no, no. But, uh, don't, don't bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> I would like to uh, tell you about what happened. Aunt? Netflix uh, new um, new comedy special, Notorious. Yeah, as long as the language isn't very salty. Well, it's got Russell Peters. You know Russell Peters. He's great. He's one of the biggest comedians in the whole wide world. Well, now, along with Orange is the New Black, House of Cards, and Arrested Development, you got Notorious. That's his newest uh, special, Russell Peters. And um, this guy's huge, right? Over 75 million views on YouTube. Well, A million Facebook that's, fans. That's mind-blowing. That is mind-blowing, isn't it? And uh, one of the most diverse audiences on the planet, apparently. Uh, multicultural, I guess. Uh, oh, boy, he sold out Madison Square Garden, Sydney's Whoa. Royal Opera House. And um, also launching with Russell's new special, Notorious, it's Russell Peters versus the world. I'm, I'm, I can't even sell a beefsteak Charlie's. <laughs> <laughs> Where? <laughs> When was the last time you saw a beef steak Charlie's? Well, something to that, to that you know, effect. I mean, you know, like, <laughs> bad bingo halls, like, in the middle of nowhere. I, <laughs> yeah. I love the reference. I haven't seen a beef steak Charlie's in 20 you're, fucking years. You're quickly becoming my favorite person in the I world. I love them. I love them. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, along with oh Russell's God, uh, new special, God. Notorious, Russell Peters vs. the World is an exclusive four-part <laughs> series that takes you behind the scenes of Russell's uh, oh. tour. Tons of great outtakes and interviews with his friends is and family. Is he dirty like, like uh, Sam Kennison? Uh, I, I don't know. Is uh, Russell Peters very dirty? I don't think so. No, not necessarily. No, no. Big, uh, big audience. Yeah, you know, he's like, one of these like very Disney, marketable comedians. Is he friendly? Like, like, you know, like... Uh, Balloon animal jokes, things like that. Like, well, you know, I think it's more know. than that. If you're going to get 75 oh, yeah. million Whoa, viewers on that's YouTube, awesome, be, well, <laughs> well, yeah. So don't miss, you know, notorious, and uh, of course, Russell Peters versus the world. Could, could he? He'll probably kick my butt if he, he'll hunt me. Well, he don't have time to hunt me down. He's well. selling out stadiums. <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. He's selling out Madison Square Garden. And, the, uh, he didn't have time to worry about some fat guy someplace. <laughs> well, no, no, he wouldn't. He wouldn't. And, uh, of course, <laughs> Russell Peters versus the world. He'll, he'll send me some, but he'll send uh, somebody to kick yeah. my ass. you got that kind of money now. Like, uh, right. He's got kick people's ass money. He can just go punch that fat guy out. From right. Him, he'll eat popcorn while right. get my ass kicked. I hear you. And that's I'm a, in, by the way, the second episode of this. Oh, you are? Oh, yes, because oh. I interviewed Russell for uh, Town Hall. Nice. Oh, I'll see I'll cool. that then. Yeah. And that, of course, is streaming, and it's only. How old is he about? <laughs> uh, I'm not even sure. Is he oh. like, he's, he's not my age, he's probably... Oh, I God. think he's younger. He's like 40, wow. he's 43. Yeah. God bless him, that's amazing. It's like 75 million, whoa, God almighty. It's well, like, yeah. yeah. Russell my- Peters, Notorious, and Russell Peters versus the World, now <laughs> streaming. <laughs> Only. Can you give me some whores? <laughs> I think I want to be friends with him. That I mean, 75 million people. He got to have an army of skanks. I'm sure. He does. Uh, okay. <laughs> we got one more read. Uh, uh, only on got to be Netflix. Whores, I mean. <laughs> Netflix. <laughs> Uh, Mike, can you do our last live read, please? Oh, I, I, we I, do not feel like doing it. Yeah, I'd okay, really yeah. appreciate it. If you ask any girl, any woman, what the best she can ever got was without. Situation. Oh, not a fucking idiot. I'm sorry. Without even uh, thinking about it, she makes her engagement ring is so important. It's just not a ring. It's just a sign of affection. It's everything to her. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'll start again. I'm sorry. If you ask any girl, any woman, what the best gift she ever got was, without he- hesitation, without even thinking about it, uh, she'll say her engagement ring. Okay, honey, don't fucking lie to me. It's so important because. <laughs> It's not just the ring, not just the sign of affection. It's everything to a. Hey, Mike, time. Mike, Mike. Huh? Uh, the, the client wants us to improvise these. So when we, <laughs> oh, okay, sure. improvise a little bit, read it, like, and then like a one really like, I mean, that's just like a script to follow, which we, you know. But then when you're feeling some okay. some improv, just throw it in there okay. for us. The, yeah. the client really okay, appreciates thank you guys. that. And, it does, and honestly, it doesn't matter what you say. So okay. don't hold back. If you ask any be girl, Mike, be Mike Bichette. Oh, thank you guys. If you ask right. any girl, any woman, she, the best thing she got was a piece of my balls. <laughs> she was without hesitation. She sucked that banana all fucking night. That filthy skank. <laughs> she said it was an engagement. Yeah, you fucking lying whore. That engagement ring wasn't even purchase the prices. That fucking ring, you fucking skankosaurus. It's not just a ring. It's a sign of affection. Yeah, you lying whore because. 
everything in the house. Yeah, okay. She, she looks down at her finger every time she washes her hands. Yeah, she don't wash her hands, that filthy pig. She got fucking scurvy on her hands, that whore. Every time someone at the store hands are changed, that's because she's sucking dick for fucking milk money. <laughs> <laughs> goes, her credit. Every time she shows her friend, yeah, her friends are fucking animals like her. They're, they're pigs. They're fucking handed out hand jobs for fucking eight bucks and a fucking bologna sandwich in fucking Dirt Avenue someplace in Manhattan. For that ring, that whore will fucking <laughs> chew her own dad's dick off, actually. But, uh, <laughs> what do you call it? She's so perfect. Yeah, she's perfect. L listen, whore, shut the fuck up and bite the bone. <laughs> what do you call it? Yes, yeah, Stephen singing. Who the fuck is this jeweler? He's a fucking idiot. He's <laughs> pussy since fucking the third grade, that idiot. What do you call it? And uh, it's painless. Yeah, all right. So many of our guys have made it to the trip. What? This guy's a fucking nincompoop. <laughs> he has some fucking. Poop. He is. I mean, 100% money back guarantee. You gotta give me my money back. Because that whore ain't worth a fucking pack of cigarettes, really. Because <laughs> you get the best service, the best. Yeah, okay, look. You can do it. Listen, I'm sick of that whore. I'm not even gonna call that skank. I'll put on my, you know, fucking whore list and, you know, uh, just, you know, a booty call that whore and just text me when you want a fucking dick in your mouth, skank. What do you call it? Because I just uh, love whores. <laughs> Steven Singer Jewelers. That's the uh, other oh. corner of 8th and Wilder. Right, of course. Do you have the phone number there, Mike, for the people? Oh, just read the, read the bottom part. You actually part. have to give the real okay, number. Okay, 1-888-HATE-STEVEN-SINGER. Align it. I hate Steven Singer dot com. Very good. That was actually great. That was it. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, I, I, I got a <laughs> What? 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 No, it's fun. I, I, oh, yeah. Oh. Thank you. I, I, I we really lost, love We might have lost a client, but <laughs> fuck it. It's all right. Yeah, the oh, language God. is a little rough. Oh, oh, a little I'm rough. Sorry. We didn't oh, expect you to kidding? go that rough with that. You know? I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. I just got a, a brutal filthy story. between the lines, I mean, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> oh, God. It's all right. Jim is my mentor, really. I mean, he was always a good guy to me oh. when we started comedy. He never took any shit from people. I love him for that reason. He's taking you... shit from certain girls. <laughs> <laughs> Women will do that to everybody, no matter who well, you are, really. I mean, they true. can eat you up like a alive. chest and face. You guys yeah. have known each other a while? Or? Since, like, 91. Wow. Yeah. Well, I'm going to pause it there. That was hilarious. That was hilarious. I can't believe I ain't done these before. Definitely, Mike Bichetti, Opie and Anthony is going to be my Opie and Anthony. He's just so funny. And they're actually good. I'll tell you what else is good as well. I know people don't like Sam. But all the way through, you've just heard Sam laughing in the background. Like, Sam loves the kind of oddballs like Mike Bichetti. Pretty much because he is one. Like, he's like the king of them. But you can hear in the background the whole time. Sam is just creasing at everything Mike Bichetti says. But yeah, that's part two. And yeah. Yeah, I'll carry on. Maybe later, actually. But yeah, anyway, that's the reaction. Sweet. <laughs>